Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am actually reviewing one of my holy grail products. So I'm very excited. It is Shiseido Anessa sunscreen. It's called Perfect UV Sunscreen Skincare Gel SPF 50 Plus PA Plus Plus Plus. So SPF 50 Plus means it protects your skin against 98% of the sun's ray. Uh, don't ask me about the remaining 2%. I don't know what happened to it, but 98% sounds pretty good to me. PA++++ means it allows an individual to handle 16 times more UVA rays. And it's pretty much the highest protection grade that you can get on the market right now. So if you're looking for a sunscreen right now, look out for SPF 50 plus and also look out for PA++++ plus 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 four pluses. Now recently I have been hearing a lot of people saying, oh my god, is a physical sunscreen? Is a chemical sunscreen? Oh it's a combo. Physical sunscreen is literally how it sounds like. It is a physical barrier between you and the sun ray. So think of somebody with zinc on their nose on the beach or I don't know, a lifesaver with zinc on their nose. Um, that's physical sunscreen. Chemical sunscreen is pretty much chemicals in the sunscreen that you, once you put on your skin, it goes into your skin and it absorbs the UVA rays. Which one is better? Um, it really depends. Physical sunscreen has less, you know, chemicals, duh. Um, so it's probably better for somebody with more, you know, sensitive skin or children who need gentle products. Whereas chemical sunscreen has a lot of antioxidants, your vitamin E's and things like that. This sunscreen here is a combination of both physical and chemical. What I also love about this is it's quite lightweight. It is a sunscreen gel. So if you look at it like this, it comes out quite nicely and it's quite light. It goes on smoothly and sinks into your skin really quickly. So it really doesn't take long for it to, you know, go into your skin. As you can see, there is no white cast whatsoever. In terms of the smell, there is a light um, sunscreen smell, but it's actually quite pleasant. This bottle here costs about um, $60 if you were to buy it online. Um, and as I mentioned, it is the gel version. So if you have um, dry skin or if, if you live in Canada or somewhere that's really cold, I would recommend Anessa's Mild Milk and Skin Milk. As the name suggests, they're quite milky and a bit more oily. So out of 10, I would give this product a 9. The reason I'm deducting a point is because um, the ingredient list number 8 is ethanol, which is alcohol. So it is not an alcohol-free product. But other than that, it's pretty awesome. And I wear it every single day. I've been wearing this product since two years ago. This one is my holy grail product because I have also tried Corsa X Aloe Soothing Sunscreen, the Natio Sunscreen, and the Cancer Council Sunscreen. And this one by far is the most lightweight. The Corsa X one is cheaper, but it has a very strong smell, which I don't like. So that's it for today. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite sunscreen is. Until then, I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.